Good afternoon. This is Sir Timothy Thrapp, World Improvement Through the Spirit Ministries with additional World Improvement Technologies. We are, I am spokesman for a group of ministers, scientists, engineers. Uh, we've developed uh, quite a few interesting things over the last 200 years. This is a demonstration. Uh, well, the reason we're putting these demonstrations on YouTube is for the fundraiser. We would like to get uh, a home power system in mass production. And so anybody that uh, feels led to help, please do. You check out our website. Uh, you'll see that we're honest and sincere. Feel free to check out the members area. It's a pay-per-view area where you can read uh, all the different uh, scientists and engineers that have tested our stuff, their testimonials. There'll be some video testimonials either up on YouTube or in that area soon. And uh, if everybody feel free to check it out. There's also some bills there where people have uh, significantly reduced their utility bills. In one case, the reading is negative. So they've uh, actually uh, uh, produced more power than they're consuming at that particular place. And uh, so we've also posted a number of bills there in the members area just to help people understand what's, what's going on and that it's real and it's valid and it's reproducible. And we've been doing it for about 200, well, about 140 years for the homes, and cars about 100, about 100 years for automobiles. Yeah, the first, uh, the first of our, the cars that the ministries did, was, the ministry, World Improvement Ministries did, was back about 1910 or so, and uh, this first house was back in the 1870s or so. Stubblefield uh, was in charge of the ministry in those days, Nathan Stubblefield and you can look him up online if you want to learn more about him. Uh, anyway, so we're going to demonstrate today the ability of uh, uh, a machine to run with basically an open circuit. This is harnessing a little bit of energy right out of the human body, is what's going on here, or right out of the environment, if you want to say it that way. And basically quantum energy is right out of the environment, and it is available, it is abundant, it is free. Uh, except you do have to buy and build the machinery that goes with it. It's, uh, you know, it's not like somebody's just going to hand it to you. Uh, so people need to cooperate to get the factory going so we can get these masks produced at a reasonable price. So if everybody that sees this video would donate a couple dollars, we'd probably be ready to do it within six months or a year. So that's what we're asking people to do. Go check it out. Check out our website. Um, there's a request a gift. There's a lot of things already in mass production that you can request. Uh, energy devices, a few things. I shouldn't say a lot, a few things. And uh, there's also uh, plans and kits that you can build. And uh, check out our members area because that's where all the testimonials are. And we do plan to put more testimonials on YouTube soon. So, uh, shall I go ahead and start? Oh, that's good. Okay, I would like to mention that Steve, the cameraman, is, Steve Smith, is uh, a very competent engineer, and he's been volunteering to help the ministry now for a couple of years, and we really appreciate him. And he has looked this whole thing over, and he can tell you there's no tricks. This is the real thing. And he's looked all of our systems over, and he can tell you the, is that, is that correct, Steve? I will give you a confirmation that there are no hidden tricks here, no additional wires uh, adding on to... Uh, the, uh, the demo that we're doing here, it all is self-contained and uh, as stated. Okay. And like I say, you can go on the website. There's uh, about 20-some other people's testimonials that we've listed there. And if you really want to talk to any of those people, just make the appropriate donations. We'll get them on the phone. And uh, this is we are the only organization that actually has testimonials. Everybody else, there's one, one guy usually, and maybe two guys in some cases, and uh, that's it. They're both, uh, nobody whatsoever has confirmed that anything is real as far as I know on all these other organizations that are supposedly working in this field. And so we've got 20-some 20, 20 posted freely for everybody to see, so that should make a difference. Anyway, um, without further ado, I'm going to read, read the reading on the battery pack, and then we're going to hook it up and run it for a while, even open circuit. And we'll see the uh, we'll see what all happens here. Everything goes right. The battery will be higher when we're done than when we started, and the uh, and the, it'll run faster when it's open circuit than when it's closed circuit. Okay, we're reading 194.1 on the battery pack, and hopefully you can see where I'm reading. Everybody can. You try to scoot, scoot right in because people will try to say that I hit, hooked it to a different battery or something. So try to scoot right in there. I don't know if you can. How about my hands here? You can. 194.4. 4. 
Yeah, okay. So you see where it's connected right on the, hopefully you see right where it's connected. I don't know if you can see in there or not, but see right where it's connected, 194.4. So when I'm done, we'll hopefully get the same, you know, there's no tricks going on here. These people that constantly write me and tell me there's tricks, it uh, gets me going. It's only about 1 out of 20, but it only takes 1 out of 20 sometimes to get you going. But anyway, so 194.4 is what we had. Mm -hmm. And we'll start her up and run her open circuit. Um, let me connect up the leads on the battery pack. And see if you have any questions you think should be, anything should be added. We're all just volunteers here, so <coughs> nobody's a professional salesman in this group, and that's probably, uh, that's what keeps everybody honest, basically. So, <laughs> uh, if you have any questions or thoughts, feel free. And we'll start her up. And it'll take a little bit of fiddling to get uh, to get all the adjustments right. There we go. Tim, let me zoom in there to see the uh, see the magnet turning. The magnet turning. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to adjust it down to where it's barely turning, and and then when I open the circuit, you'll notice it speeds up. Yep, just a little too slow here. <laughs> 